landed in Rome. It seems like three days ago that we left the house, but you know, it takes a while and our plane was delayed a little bit in one point of the whole trip, but we made it and we're here and this is what it looks like after sleeping on a plane. Um, but we're here and we're excited. So we're trying to make our way to Naples um, right now. So we are in a rental car and we are headed down the road to Naples. We are headed out to find some pizza. We were told a very authentic place that's off the tourist track and we are gonna go find it and eat there, we hope. morning we um, had a fabulous dinner we had pizza um, just a little walk away from our hotel Bare, uh, it's actually a bed and breakfast but anyway um, and we walked around saw some sights took some pictures and with jet lag and all we were happy to come back to the room and just sort of clean up and relax and prepare for the next day. So to now is the next day. Um, didn't sleep terribly well because you know how it goes when you're on a complete different time zone all at, all at once, but we did pretty well and we are getting ready to check out of this um, B&B, grab some coffee and hit the road and go to Pompeii. So today is the Pompeii day and uh, we're looking forward to that a lot. So that'll be interesting. So we're gonna hit the road, go find our car. It's in a garage somewhere near here and uh, and hit the road.
we just finished um, touring Pompeii. That was quite spectacular, to be honest. It was amazing. Um, so happy we did that. So we are now going to drive, it's about an hour to drive to our um, bed and breakfast in Positano. So that's where we're headed now in our car and see the sights on the way. So we're gonna head to Positano. we enter. This place is gorgeous. Take a look. front door. Laundry down there. We have a lovely living area. And a full kitchen. I don't know how much we'll use that, but we have it. We have one bathroom in here. There's a bedroom and another bathroom downstairs. Or the other bathroom is downstairs. We have two bedrooms. Don't know why, but we need them. We don't need them, but you know, this is the size of the place. So we enjoyed traveling around, uh, walking up and down the steps to around Positano today, the, once we got into this incredible um, bed and breakfast and got the lay of the land, grabbed a few things at a grocery store. And we are, then we came back to the room and tried to regroup and figure out our lives and rest for a little bit because we are walking to dinner. Um, it's about a 20 minute walk down a lot of stairs and it's probably gonna take about an hour to get back after dinner and a couple glasses of wine. 
<laughs> but it'll be straight uphill on the way back we might take a taxi we'll see but um we're getting ready to go make that big walk down to dinner and it should be amazing but i just cannot get over this place and the grapes that are hanging right there right there it's just just stunning it's so pretty So we are finished with dinner. It was absolutely wonderful. Fresh fish, a salad, wonderful dessert, a couple glasses of wine. Now we start our long trek back uphill. It's something, let me tell you. Good morning. Woke up in Positano this morning. What a beautiful thing. Um, I'm making coffee. Doing the best I can. Um, it's a perfectly beautiful kitchen. So, um, and they had coffee and a coffee maker and it looks like it's probably self-explanatory. So did that. Um, but just to be able to walk out here and see Positano. Stunning. So it's a good morning so far. Um, we're getting a very slow start to the day because we're exhausted from yesterday. <laughs> um, and we're just, you know, traveling and all that kind of stuff. So we are going to group here, regroup here for a minute and see what we're going to do and figure out how we're going to get there because that's another issue altogether. And um, yeah. We'll see what happens today, but first, coffee. Okay, we are headed out. We're gonna go pick up our car and we're going to drive to Amalfi. Got the car. It's a gorgeous day. Thank you. 
Yes. It's a drive through restaurant. made our way from Positano down the coast to Amalfi and now we are working our way from Amalfi up to Ravello and we're just kind of uh, working our way up there every once in a while we have to stop for a bit on the road because of buses and whatnot so it's it's a journey but um it's not bad I mean we thought driving might be an issue but it's it's I mean obviously my husband's a good driver and he knows what to do and things but um it's not as bad as I thought anyway. I'm not horrified or scared, so <laughs> it's kind of fun and you get to stop and see things a little bit. So yeah, enjoying it. We saw Amalfi and we went to Ravello and we saw the Villa Ruffalo and all sorts of things. And we are on our way back now, uh, doing the Amalfi Coast Drive back to Positano. And uh, it's gonna probably be a good hour or so in the car. It's gorgeous, so that's fine with me. And then we're gonna relax a little bit and have dinner. We have dinner reservations in Positano um, later on. Made it back to Positano, parked the car, heading up all the steps. This part right here I'll show you is the most daunting, brutal part. Already walked up from there, up all this. Now I've got this. It just keeps going and going and going.
walking around Positano by the um, marina and checking out where the beach club is because we're going there tomorrow. In the meantime, we are um, stopping to get some pizza and a lemon spritz and just uh, checking out shops and we found a fantastic vase that uh, we got as an anniversary gift that we'll have and it's beautiful. It's going to be um, made for us because we, just, we wanted a smaller size than the one we saw. So uh, it's all sorts of fun. I'm excited and I'm very hungry. So this pizza is going to taste delicious. Good morning. We are getting ready to have a beach day. Yesterday was relaxing and good. And then today um, we are going to spend the entire day at the beach club. We rented a section with chairs and umbrella and so forth. And we're gonna head down there and spend the day just sort of enjoying the water and laying around and people watching and just relaxing. Um, and then tomorrow we head to uh, Capri Opry, whichever. And that sounds like a wonderful plan to me. So we've had a good mix of visiting places, seeing things, driving places, walking a lot, eating good food, um, and relaxing. And today is going to be a good relaxing day. So let's head down to the beach. Sono tutti stesi, i loro cuori ti hanno visto e si sono resi. Mi guardo nello specchio e penso, ma come fai? La mente torna indietro al nostro primo incontro, storia, letto fine come in un racconto. Ti dico che sei bella e tu scherzi, ma quando mai? Dove siamo adesso? Nei tuoi occhi la parte migliore di me Io volo sul mondo Amanti nello spazio Baci in slow motion sul set Yesterday was amazing. Um, that beach day was absolutely everything we needed at the moment. We were just kind of tired of touring around and walking and so forth. So we literally plopped ourselves down. We got um, the set is like a, a little platform with a double lounger and towels and pillows and a little table with chairs and an umbrella and it was just this perfect little spot for us. Um, I reserved that months ago um, and I'm glad I did because it was absolutely so perfect. My food was delicious. I had pasta. That was the first pasta of the trip. I figured I had to have some. Um, you know, when in Italy, you got to try it at least. So yeah, I did that. It was great. Um, just a very relaxing, wonderful day. And um, we made it back <laughs> up the hill uh, and just sort of relaxed and gathered our things together and semi-packed for this morning because we are leaving Positano today. We have arranged for a taxi to take us down closer to the marina which we still have to schlep our luggage from the taxi stand to the marina, but that's just how it goes. Um, it's interesting. And then we're catching a boat over to Capri and um, we're gonna be there for a couple nights. And so I'm excited. So today is travel day over to the next place. And uh, it's gonna be another day of just interesting stuff. So I'm excited.
Capri. And this is where we're staying. It's a gorgeous place. Upstairs. We have our bathroom. And the bedroom. Beautiful. Capri, enjoying it, taking a look around. Um, tomorrow we have a boat tour and a dinner because tomorrow's our actual anniversary. And we're checking out the funicular because it's the easiest way to get from up here down to the marina to catch the boat for the boat tour. So we're checking out the funicular ticket area and seeing what that's gonna be all about for tomorrow morning. Perfect weather, it's gorgeous here. headed out to dinner now and looking forward to it so we think we're just gonna stop by a place we have no reservations or anything we're just gonna stop by a place that we saw earlier when we were wandering around and um, hopefully there'll be something for us there It was a piece of fish. It was cod? No. What was it? Sea bass. Sea bass. It was sea bass and it was very good. It was with capers and olives and it was yummy. And I had that. I originally tried to get the fish with the vegetables, but it was instead, um, they, they suggested I get this instead. And I did and it was absolutely beautiful. And I had bread with olive oil and balsamic and it was so, so good. And we're really enjoying this wine and these crazy crackers. very dry but I'm glad we got to try them because I've heard about how dry they are <laughs> we're having a great time I got my gelato the first gelato of the trip so did Jim It's beautiful here. 
it's just And we're home. Good morning. This is our last full day here. Um, it's our anniversary, 35 years today. So that's really fun. We are taking a boat. We're going to go down the funicular, down back to the marina, meet Roberto by a restaurant. He's our skipper of our boat. We have a four hour boat tour. And I'm um, not sure what else to expect of it, but that's what's happening this morning. And then we'll come back, relax a little bit, and we have a nice dinner plan for this evening. So that is, this is our last full day of our trip. And then tomorrow we're heading back to Rome and then flying back the next day. So we're excited, we're happy, and it's our anniversary.
we're back. We made it. We had the best time. It was a gorgeous boat ride. Um, the water is such a sapphire blue. Unbelievable. Fabulous time. So we made it back up the funicular. We're at our hotel room. Gonna go find something to eat. We are headed to dinner. It's our last dinner here. We're excited about it. We have quite a walk and um, we're gonna go. It's gonna be good. We are wandering our way back from dinner. It was delicious. Um, I'm way too full. This has been a fantastic trip. Loved every second of it. It's been a great anniversary. And we're happy to have been here. Thank you guys so much for joining me. Love you.